that death is something that can come at any moment. Listen to me, brothers and sisters. They would lie down inside their grave and they would say what Allah says. They say in the Quran after the angel of death takes their soul, they will say, Allah send me back. Please Allah, when they see the angels, the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said in Surah Al-An'am, uh, the Prophet uh, rather Allah said to the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam in Surah Al-An'am, Allah said, Ya O oh Messenger, if only you could see them on that day when the angels rip their soul out of them, they will be striking their faces and slapping their backs and they will say, please send me back. Allah said, they'll be slapping their faces as they're pulling their souls out of them. Send me back. Please send me back. I'll pray this time. I'll, I'll, I'll dump that girl this time. I won't play around with the girls no more. No more cigarettes. No more weed. No more watching things online. No more talking to the guys. No more music. No more disrespecting my parents. I will pray. Allah, please send me back. Tell these angels, hold me down for a second. Send me back. Just... Just two minutes, send me back. Oh, let me die with my head on the ground in sajda. Let me die. But Allah says, no, you will not be able to return. They will scream, Rabbi Rji'uni. Send me back, my master, please. But so the Salaf would lie down in the grave whilst they're still alive. And they would say this to Allah. They would say, Rabbi Rji'uni. My master, send me back. Rabbi Rji'uni. Send me back. Please, send me back. Then they would come outside of their grave. They would look at themselves. The time will come when you will say these words of Allah. The ink is dried and the pens have been lifted. And it's the hell. 